Oh. No, I'm good. Y yes Yes? Interesting. So you can just skip? Huh. Are you? There. Are we connected? Excellent. Truly. Excellent. Ooh, I haven't done this in so long. Now. We may begin. First, you must create a vessel. Select the head that you prefer. Hello everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome to Deltarune? I guess this is... Oh, well, it's confusing. I played Chapter 2 on the channel, but not Chapter 1. So now I'm playing Chapter 1, which technically means I'm returning to it, but in, order, in terms of the playlist order, it'll probably be at the front, so it's a welcome to. Huh. Either way, the reason I decided to do this is because Toby Fox just put out a whole new newsletter about Chapters 3 and 4, and technically 5, I guess, that they're going to be ready soon-ish. You know, probably, I wouldn't expect them at least until next year at the minimum. But, there was a footnote that caught my interest in that the console versions are going to be getting a release the same date as the PC versions. Which, it wasn't a thing before, he's never done that. It was always, it's on the PC, and then it comes to the consoles eventually. But if he's going to be doing day one PlayStation, Switch, Xbox releases, I'm going to play it on the PlayStation. I'd much prefer to, so now I have to make a new file. Which actually is not a bad thing. This game is very fun. It does mean I have to fight Jevil again. Oh well. I know this part doesn't really matter, but let's. Uh. Forgot how weird some of these are. That one, I guess. Select the torso that you prefer. Oh, right. Isn't there, like... The legs are this very little difference? The sleeves rolled up. Sleeves all the way... Or puffy jacket. Puffy jacket behind the hand. That one. Yeah, the legs are, like, almost identical. Except the one is, like, to the right, I think. Left, 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 left. Yeah. Number three. This is your body. Do you accept it? Yes. Excellent. You have created a wonderful form. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite food? Ah, salty. Your favorite blood type? C. What color does it like most? Well, there's no purple here. I guess red. Please give it a gift. We'll go with kindness. How do you feel about your creation? It will not hear. Oh. Have you answered honestly? Yes. You acknowledge the, possi the possibility of pain and seizure. Understood. We'll just... Uh... Sure, we'll just call it zombie. It's my go-to. I wonder... I'm sure there will be something that comes of this character creation bit. I'm just curious what it's going to be. We called it... Zombie. And what about the creator? It'll also be zombie.
Interesting that it uses an in-game keyboard, not a PlayStation one. Zombie. Of course. Of course. Of course. They are the same. Zombie. Thank you. For your time. Your answers. Your wonderful creation. Will now be discarded. No one can choose who they are in this world. Your name is... Chris. Chris, if you do not wake up, we will be late for school. I will wait outside for you, alright? It's me! Well, technically, it's not me. It's Chris. Closed drawer. Your bed. The drawer is mostly empty, except for a school cross-country shirt with a tear in it. There are CDs under the bed. Classical jazz, religious ska. It's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Or, how's, I don't remember how the line goes. It's a red wagon with a rusty birdcage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. It's stained. What else can I look at in here? There are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails do not have tails, a scientific refutation. Can snails help your garden? Eh, not really. An assigned copy of the History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boom. Gerson. A cactus. There's not much to say about it. There are crayons in the drawer. Their labels have long faded, and there's no green. It's only you. The door's locked. You looked inside the sink cupboard. There's... A can of Icy's Cool Boys Body Spray, spray for the boys. Flaming hot pizza flavor. It seems to be almost entirely full. It's a toilet. Flush it? Yes. You flush the toilet. It's a toilet. Flush it? Yes. You flush the toilet. It's a toilet. Flush it? Yes. You flush the toilet. Chris, is everything all right in there? Flush it. Again. Again. Chris, what are you doing? You did not put a bath bomb in the toilet again, did you? I forget how many times she does she has responses. Chris, if anything bad happens, you are paying for the plumbing bill. Okay, I think that's three. On a shower ledge is a small container of apple scented shampoo. And a gallon sized container of pet shampoo. When does the music start? There's a photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. There's some cinnamony batter caked on the stovetop. Cute cookie cute, uh, cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. It's a trash can. Somehow, it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. It's a landline phone. You should already have a cell phone. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. It's a TV. Doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. Huh. Now that's not something I remembered. The uh, end of chapter 2 has consequences for that line. It's a book of hymns. What about hers? How many people made that joke? Ooh, I like the filler on this. I don't know if that's going to how I put this, hmm, it might not show up in the capture, or on my recording, because 
I'll have this shifted over, but maybe. We'll see. With a nice frame to everything. Chris, there you are. We might still be able to make it. Chris, it is a beautiful day at to today. Beautiful day today, is it not? I hope it stays this way when Azrael visits next week. But I wonder, after the excitement of university, will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? Play the music! Is Caddy in here? Oh, wait, is that Caddy or the mom? I can never remember. Undyne with two eyes. I don't know how Toby Fox did this with Undertale and then this game. It's insane. Triple A devs couldn't dream to have be as talented as him. And it's pixel! It's like low res pixel art. So, does everyone have a. Oh, Chris! We thought you weren't coming today. We're doing group projects this month. Uh, so walk around and find a partner, okay? Partner? I hardly know her. Haha, ha, ha. what do you think of that one? Funny, right? No? Well, I got news for you, pal. I already got a partner. Scram. Hey, kid. Yo, Chris, show up earlier next time. I ended up having to partner with Snowy. Ha. Uh, now he keeps turning to me and saying howdy, partner, like a cowboy. Crisp! Oh, wow, uh, very sorry. Tem already have partner. Egg. It's a black and white hard boiled egg. Sadly, it seems like it already has a partner. Tem partner with egg. You're lucky, I'd rather be partner in this than this, haha. <laughs> That's right, Chris. I got the good partner. And we're gonna be laughing all the way to the bank. Because I need money, and I'm also very funny. Oh, Birdly. Oh, Chris, late again, I see. Hmm, you need a partner? Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Though, wait, Chris, now that I think about it. Your unique skill- your unique skill set might help a lot on this assignment. Pfft, not. I actually want to get an A. Got the squashed face. Ask elsewhere, Chris. I actually want to get an A. If you can't get anyone, maybe your mom will be your partner again. Hey, Chris, what's up? Did you lose your pencil again? Here, you want the candy cane one or the one with the lights on it? Huh? You want to be partners? Uh, sorry. Birdly already asked me. But I could ask Miss Alphys if we could make a group of three. I'll ask if you're sure. Not yet. Yeah, I'm sure there's someone else you can ask. Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. Yo, Chris, you know Jockington and Caddy are always partners. We're the ultimate ca academic duo ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story. We seem different, but me and Caddy have a ton in common. Both like breathing and unhinging our jaws. Okay, I'll ask. Miss Alphys, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? Hey, what? No, I do not approve of this. Abort. What? But Chris doesn't have a... Noel, what were you saying? She was just saying we're fine being alone. Actually, I just wanted to know if... Noel, can you please speak up? It's the star of the show. Hi, Susie. Am I late? Uh, no, you're fine. We were just, uh... Choosing partners for the next group project, and... Susie, you're with Chris. Great. Now that everyone's here, I'll write the assignment. Uh, has anyone seen the chalk? This is the third time it's gone missing, and... You all know I can't start class without some. How about this? If no one speaks up... Everyone gets in trouble. Anyone? Please? Hey, there might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alphys, why don't Susie and I... Good idea, Noelle. Susie, since you came in last, why don't you go get it for me? Whatever. 
And Chris, can you go with her and make sure she uh, actually gets it and uh, stays out of trouble? Thanks, Chris. See you later. What time period is this supposed to be in if they're using chalk boards and the like still? Chris? Didn't see you there. Hey, you didn't see anything just now, did you? Hmm. You can't even say? Chris? Hey. Let me tell you a secret. Quiet people piss me off. There's your theme! You think just because you don't say anything, I can't tell exactly what you're thinking? It's over. Akatsu is eating all the chalk. This was her last chance. Now she'll finally be expelled. Ah, come on, Chris. Don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. So, congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Just let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So, Chris, if I know you're gonna pull the trigger, why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel about losing your face? Nah. Chris, you've got a good mother. It'd be a shame to make her bury her child. Alright, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk. Mosey back to class, and then, Chris, you'll do our project. How's that sound? That sounds good. Don't bother answering. If you haven't gotten it, in, gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. Let's go, freak. Man, her sprites are so different without the, before chapter 2. Can I look at some of these? Locker is locked. The locker's lock is locked. The lock's locker is locked. The locker's lock's locker is locked. The locker is covered in Jockington memorabilia. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? At this dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads and screech at any students that make contact while dancing. You drank from the fo water fountain. Yeah, people put their mouth on that, you know. Chris? What, realize the baby classroom was a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. Nah, actually, let's not. Wrong way, Chris. Isn't that like a thing you can do? Chris, you just gonna skip school? What, am I supposed to snitch on you? That'd be rich, huh? Nah, I wouldn't. Get back here. It's like a thing you can do at some point. God, can you walk any slower or what? Nah, I get it. I'm not used to walking around without someone holding your hand. Come on, freak. Well, here's the closet. Too bad. We were just starting to have fun. Hey, Chris, is it me or... Is it really dark in there? What's the holdup, Chris? Are you gonna go in or what? Fine, if you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... We'll both go in at the same time. See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try to find a light switch. That's weird. I can't find a switch. I guess it's further in. Uh, kind of big for a closet, huh? You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. Hey, Chris. I think this closet's, uh, broken. There aren't any walls. Well, we worked hard enough. If Alphys wants chalk so bad, she can get it herself. Let's split. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Oops. What the? Hey, this isn't funny. Let us out. Let us... Hmm? 
the floor, it's... I love Chris's sprite there, just... Uh... Come on, Chris, up and at him. Oh, I do have a menu. Oh, config. Uh, okay. Simplify VFX. Interesting. Chris, level one. Body contains a human soul. Okay, got a wood blade. Oh, circles run. Got it. At times, you see it flickering. The light only you can see. By second nature, you reach out and... Oh, saved over Chris. It's too dark to see anything. Oh, I saw you. Too dark to see anything. Too dark to see anything. Nope, I saw you again. Too dark to see anything. I guess this is also supposed to be very fungal. Ooh, I don't like this one. Looks like a face. What's down? There's something glowing inside. Take it. You got the glow shard. Isn't that a thing you sell? Its use is unknown. Hmm, I don't remember what that does. Just like my good old buddy Flowey. You bathe your body in the light. Power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. Any pain you may have had melted away. It should be fully restored. In this land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. Wait. Okay. Man, it has been a long time since I've done this. Someone's running from the moss. Oh. Hey, back off. Come any closer and I'll... Chris? Ooh. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. <laughs> anyway, enough screwing around. we got to find a way out of here. Um, where is here, anyway? It doesn't matter. You got us into this mess, you get us out. Either the way, Chris. Oh my god, never mind, you walk way too slow. He does walk very slow. Hey, Chris, there's someone up there waving at us. Any idea what they want? Run, Chris! Okay. I've got to get back into the Delta Rune Undertale bullet hell feel. Chris, down here. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
I have to practice for Jevil. Oh, okay. That's not remotely as bad as Jevil. Ooh, the background. Oh, you're not dead. Sweet. Got any idea what the heck this place is? Me neither. I wonder if there's anyone in that building up ahead, or up there. It looks like a shop, but the door is locked, and no one's inside. It's locked. Can I go to the right here? No, I guess she's blocking it. It's locked. It's locked. In front of you, a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please come forward, both of you. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris, Susie, there is a legend in this land. A legend that one day two heroes of light will arrive and fulfilled the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. No. Uh, really? Are you sure? It's fairly important, and, uh, in my opinion, it's a really nice prophecy. I think you quite like it. Okay. Whew, um, very well, then. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered among shadows. It was a legend of hope, a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light, a legend of dark. This is the legend of Delta Rune. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance, bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror. And the land will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at world's edge human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountains and banish the angel's heaven. Only then will balance be restored and the world saved from destruction. Today the fountain of darkness the geyser that gives this land form stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of the legend. That despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. Delta Warriors, please, won't you accept your destiny? Uh, nah. What? Me? Some kind of hero or something? You've got the wrong person. But Susie, without you, the, the world will... So what, if the world gets destroyed, it's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. Susie, wait. There he is, the boy! Ho ho ho! The heroes are already running away. And they didn't even know I was here. 
My dad's gonna make me son of the month. Who the hell are you? I'm... The bad guy. You clowns want to seal our dark fountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns. Save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Eh. Don't try to deny it. We both know you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go, go there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. Hmm, nice plan, kid. Really? Yeah, actually, mind if we use it on you instead? Lancer busts in. Uh, let's check. Lancer, attack seven, defense one. Not to call a spade a spade, but he's a spade. Not old enough to ride a motorcycle, so he set his bike on fire. No, Susie, don't hurt him. Halt, clowns, his bike is fueled by victory. Don't know how I got an axe, but, like, that's cool. You tell Lancer to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. I love to get thrashed. Just kidding, that's you. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah! Lancer's thinking about chips. You tell Lancer you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. He seems flattered. His attack power went down. Oh, you make my feelings do wheelies. Sweet wheelies. Lancer's thinking about chips. You try to compliment Lancer again. But he sees it as insincere. His attack power goes back up. Did you not realize I can mask my self-esteem levels? Nah, it's hard. Wait, wait. Wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. Are right, you punkaroos? You had the luck of the draw this time, but... Next time, the losers will be you. Ah, bye, losers. I gotta get home before dinner. You won! Got zero dollars and thirty-five... Zero XP and thirty-five dark dollars. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am... Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Ah, uh, alright. The boy! The other boy! Hello everyone, I'm Ralsei. Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're going to become great friends, and... Best way to leave is east, right? Yes, that's where he will. Got it. See you at school, Chris. Um, I suppose it's just the two of us, then. Chris, I'm a prince, but I uh, currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here um, my whole life for you two to arrive. So, I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can be good friends, Chris. Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You can lead the way, Chris. Ralph say the Lonely Prince is now your ally. The power of Fluffy Boy shines within you. Looks like a shop, but the door is locked and there's no one no one's inside. Oh, he doesn't comment on it? Isn't there a thing? Come to think of it, how did Lancer get up there? I suppose he rode his bike up the side of the cliff? Oh no, later on, that's if you miss things you can get from there. Right. Tutorialize me. Oh, Chris, it's the training dummy I made. Now seems like a great chance to prepare for the enemy. Would you like me to teach you how to fight? Yes. Okay, get ready, Chris. See the heart, Chris? That's your soul, the culmination of your being. Within, it holds your will, your compassion, and the fate of the world. If it gets hit, you and your friends will lose HP. If everyone's HP reaches zero, we'll lose the battle. So please take care to avoid the enemy's attack. Ready? Let's try dodging. Great job, Chris. You're a natural. Anyhow, after the enemy attacks, it's our turn, Chris. First, I'll teach you how to fight. Though fighting is unnecessary in this world. There's no harm in a thorough lesson. You hug Ralsei. Chris! Um, I don't think, um, this is what you're supposed to be doing. 
but let's try fighting. You hug the dummy. Huh? Chris, you'd rather hug it out than fight? You know what? That's fine. We don't need to fight. Okay, next let's try defending. Simply defend and the enemy's attack will hurt you less. Not only that, but you'll also gather TP. Watch the orange big bar on the left. I'll explain it next. Great job, Chris. Now that you've gathered TP, how about spending that TP on one of my spells? If you had, um, hit the enemy, it'd be tired now. In that case, we use my pacify spell on it. It'll fall asleep and we'll win peacefully. I also cast pacify. Great, Chris. We, can, uh, we would have won the battle by now. Now I have just a little more to teach you. Remember when you hugged the dummy by ac acting on it? Because of that, its name turned yellow. Now by using the spare command, you, win you can win. What... If I hug Rousey again. Chris, are you trying to um, ask me to give you a tutorial on hugging? What if we do it a third time? Um, I've never hugged anyone before, besides the dummy to test it out. So I don't know anything about it, sorry. I suppose you're the one teaching me, huh? Once more. Okay, we're done with that then. Chris spared the dummy. Great job, Chris. That'd be the end in a real battle. I'm really happy I had the chance to teach you, Chris. You gun. You one dark, dark dolly. Did you give me a dollar? Well, that was fun. You're a wonderful student, Chris. And, uh, in case you ever need a refresher, I... Here. I wrote a manual for you and Susie. Press triangle to open the menu and use it in your items. You got the manual. It's just a dummy. Oh my, the great door is opened. No wonder Lancer was able to come through. Chris, once we pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. A journey foretold exactly by the prophecy. But Chris, I believe your choices are important too. This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. In the end, how we treat them makes all the difference. So let's try our best to get by without fighting. If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may have a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that you may not find the result favorable. Oh, I'm sorry, is that too much to ask? I can handle it. Chris, I knew you were here the moment I saw you. Let's try our best, alright? Hmm. Ooh, the forest. With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. The power of adventure shines within you. When does the good music start? There it is. The field of hopes and dreams. Enemies ahead! You're gonna die. Signed, Lancer. Bum, bum. Rudin drew near. It's attack six, defense zero. This ambivalent diamond isn't any girl's best friend. I'm just a normal person. Rudin is glimmering plainly. Right, they can't act until... You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. It smells like jewelry. He spared Rudin. You won! Zero XP and 39 Dark Dollars. If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. Signed, Lancer. Hey, don't read this sign. It's a work in progress. Signed, Lancer. Oh, it isn't my two favorite people. Psych, you guys aren't even in my top five. Lancer, where's Susie? You mean the purple girl? Ho ho ho! You fools, you're too late to stop me! What did you do? Haha, it was so simple. She beat me up so I ran away. 
That's a bit anticlimactic. Hey, if you head that way, my troops will thrash you. Is that a threat? I prefer to think of it as an invitation. These types of trees don't contain an item that can heal you. Whatever you do, don't check the tree and use triangle to open your menu. You got it? Signed Lancer. There are two hubs hanging from the tree. Take one? Yes. You got the dark candy. There's a candy hanging from the tree. Take one? Yes. There's nothing hanging low enough to take. What does that do again? How much health? 40 HP. 40 HP is pretty good. That's a, that's a half hit, heal at this point in the game. So, are you just going to stand there? I thought you would at least run to the right. Why? The purple girl's over there. Hey, Rudin. Ooh, two Rudins. Okay. Okay. Convince you. And then spare you. You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. So I spared Rudin. Face my diamond cutter! Oh, don't get into a corner. Rudin thinks about elaborate stones. You told Rudin to quit fighting. I'll say spared Rudin. How does the recruitment thing work? I don't, I have to, I don't remember how that works. Isn't it like you recruit a certain number of mo- Oh, this the Top Chef. Mama Miba, I'm Top Chef. My latest cake worked me to exhaustion. So I took a little nap, but Mama Miba, a scary noise woke me up. A beast was hunched on the table, eating the cake like an animal. I spritzed it with water and it hissed and ran off, but my wonderful cake is... Oh, Chris, that sounds like Susie. We must be getting the, going the right way. I try to keep her out of any more trouble. Mama Miba, Mama Shiba, you know that beast? Please don't come back. The remains of the cake are still smoldering. Take a piece. The broken cake was added to your key items. Right. That's the thing you gotta do. The remains of the cake are still smoldering. That's like the best healing item in the game, I think. Hello. Oh. Uh, well, let's first convince Rudin. So we're gonna quit fighting. We'll suddenly swayed. I'll say spared Rudin. It's alright, you aren't very chatty. You're emo emotive. Hathi's body beats audibly. Hathi, attack 7, defense 0. I am a little kiss. Hathi has a little secret. You ordered Ralsei to flatter all the enemies. We don't need XP, we just keep encountering your smiles reward enough. His body beats audibly. He won! 64 dark dollars. Ooh, more candy. Yeah, dark candies. Is it? I think dark candy is... Dark candy is 40, and then light candy is like 100. Check the clock. In order to solve this puzzle, you'll have to hurry. Okay. The Maze of Death. Behold, the Maze of Death. Prepare to get lost, clown. Signed, Lancer. It's interesting that triangle's the menu button and not start. But hey! Back in Deltarune, I'm getting back into things. I'm excited for this. I'm gonna get my butt kicked by a clown later on, but an actual clown, not the ones that Lancer is using loosely. But uh, yeah, we'll continue in the next episode. So thanks for joining me. Come back, I'll have the next stuff up real soon. But until then, bye.